Hello and welcome to Bro Duel. This time we have battle fatigue and injuries. The mod comes from an author that's created a variety of different realism mods, and this particular one, as you might imagine, focuses on the realism of battle. The mod makes it so there's some sort of punishment for taking hit after hit during the many battles you'll face on your adventure. So losing a certain amount of health in a short amount of time will lead to injuries, and depending on the type of injury you'll receive various negative side effects. So for example if you injure your arm then you'll be less efficient at pickpocketing, archery, one-handed combat etc. But if you receive a head injury then you'll be less effective in alchemy, speechcraft and other mental skills. The way it works is that you'll receive an active effect that lowers your skill levels, so any perks you unlock might be lost when you have an injury. The first injury you'll receive will generally be mild, but if you ignore it then other injuries will happen with increasing effects, so it's best not to ignore them. If you notice you have an injury then you have a few different options. You can temporarily subdue the negative effects with a bandage. Bandages can be bought from most vendors that sell alchemy items, or you can make your own bandage by soaking a roll of paper in a health potion. However, that's only a quick fix if you need to clear a dungeon before you can properly heal. If your injuries are small, then you can simply sleep until you receive the well-rested bonus. But if your injuries are much bigger, then you'll need to receive the Divine's Blessing from a Priestess, like Danica Purespring in Whiterun. The mod also adds Battle Fatigue. Fatigue will temporarily decrease your max health, stamina and magicka and you'll be affected by it whenever your health drops below 25 points. So if you're losing a battle and you keep having to heal yourself over and over, you'll lose more of your base stats over time, making the battle increasingly difficult. What's great is that the mod also works for nearby NPCs, including your followers. So if a follower receives an injury, then they'll automatically use a bandage if they have it in their inventory, and if you feel they need to, you can tell them to go to the nearest healer to get fully healed. NPCs and enemies around you will also be affected by fatigue, which works especially well alongside AI mods that makes NPCs use healing potions and spells much more often. Although the mod works fine on its own, it was designed to work alongside other realism and basic needs mods. The author recommends his own eat and sleep mod that adds things like hunger, exhaustion and thirst. He's added extra compatibility to make it so you're more hungry and tired when you're injured. The mod also works alongside the injure kit mod and you can use the bandages from it to help with injuries. Sometimes with mods like these it's hard to get the balancing right, sometimes the negative effects will be too harsh and common, or too small and unnoticeable. To help with that, the authors included a mod menu where you can tweak everything you'd need to. You can change the rate of an injury, the types of injuries, how long it takes to heal and more. And overall, Battle Fatigue and Injuries is a great mod for realism and immersion. The only slight complaint we have is that the debuffs are a little spammy in the active effects window, but it isn't too big of a deal. So if you're interested in the mod then you can find a link down below, and if you're interested in more mods like this then be sure to let us know down below and we'll cover a couple of the author's other realism mods. And thanks for watching.